A today I'm checking out the Daxus on D501A Red Dot. Let's see what we got. Oh, it comes in a nice hard shell case. Good, durable. And inside we got a cleaning cloth, bags of screws, mounting hardware, low profile mount. This is nice. So it's got that cross bolt there. You just unbolt it from the upper larger mount and then just bolt it right into there. Here's a unit. It's aluminum, anodized black. It's got a really nice cool design to it. And it's got these see-through lens covers. So you can just pop those up if you want to look directly through the optic or you can pop them down. You can still see through it very well. And those just pop off both sides. And in the front, there's also a kill flash. It's got a honeycomb pattern. It just screws on and off so you can switch it out. And there's that cross bolt on the larger mount as well. You got a battery cover here. Just thread that off. It's really nice and easy to switch out the battery. And for windage and elevation, there's covers, and those are used as a tool to adjust the windage and elevation. So it's half MOA clicks. And on the left-hand side, there's the plus and minus buttons to increase and decrease the brightness or to shut off the light altogether. And it also allows you to change the reticle. So there's a mix between a dot, a circle dot, no dot in the middle of the circle you just hold the button to switch between the different options and then a non-connected circle with a dot in the middle and then just a non-connected circle without the dot in the middle and just a dot so it gives you a lot of options which is nice if you're looking for a multi-reticle red dot this is a great option let's see it on a rifle so look clear so you just loosen up that cross bolt and slip it over the picatinny slides on and then you just tighten it down and you have everything you need there to get it mounted on it looks great on there it's got a nice crisp uh, clear glass which is great and all those different reticles and throw those little lens caps back on and you can see how you can pop them down or pop them up depending on how you like it it just looks really nice on the rifle it's a nice kind of small footprint a lot of features baked in well that is the daxis on d501a red dot thanks for checking it out